emotional and lost influence? Like, how do you guide process um, that, that particular period of engagement? Yeah, you just try and focus on, on the next job, or not even on the next job, just stay in reality and or where we are at the moment and what we should do to win. So we play what we see, we try and manage the game and we really hope we make the right decisions. If it's not the right decision, we try and force to make it the right decision. By that, I mean if it's a bad kick, we chase and we make it a good kick. So that's the culture in the team. We try and make a, control everything and, and make sure it works out. It's been a while since the Springboks won the Freedom Cup and it's within reach now. You've won two Rugby World Cups, but what would that mean to you as a, as a group potentially to, to push on and win yeah, the Yeah, it would be awesome. Um, yeah, I think we won it last in 29 or something like that. Um, but again, it's nice for the trophies and the stuff, but what we can do as a team and we've got a job to do, um, we get paid to do this and we get guys pay a lot of money to come and watch us. So we've got to represent them and make sure they get value for their money as well. Just a word on Ron um, his first All Black test. Is he a simple player to run for most things? No, Ron is an awesome player. He was put in calm today in the lineups. He did so well. Um, worked out with Coach Dion a lot of lineups options. Um, no, I must have a lot of respect for him and just shows his regard for the future as well. How was it playing for Lock for the first time? And uh, do you think that coming through a game like this now gives you guys a bit of extra options and takes a bit of pressure off with the sort of the injury crisis you guys have there? Yeah, my ears are that's all. <laughs> um, but yeah, it's it's it's. Uh, I'll do anything, anything, play any position for this team. So again, we, we did the hard work in the week, and uh, they asked me to to do it, and I'm more than happy. I'm capable to do it, and I'm happy with the performance. Peter, talk to us about the crowd. I mean, I've been to Elliot Park a few times, and so you probably played here quite a lot. So talk to us about this crowd tonight. Yeah, it's unbelievable. Um, just you know, the whole anthem when I sang, it's unbelievable, and the support we got in the school. Four points. It's yeah. It's, it's awesome to play here, and just thanks to all the, everyone that came to support us. We really.